This is how you level the build plate of the Elegoo Jupiter per the manufacturer's instructions. These are the four leveling lock screws. So the first thing you do is you loosen up these screws. Mine are already just finger tight. If they're any tighter than that, you have to use the hex wrench to loosen those screws. The way that these leveling screws are used in here has a little bit of a flaw. Because when you tighten this leveling set screw against the vertical screw, it's the outer rim of this screw which is pushing against the vertical screw. And the issue with that is it digs into the vertical screw and it can also throw the vertical screw off adjustment. So like if you're tightening this down, you could think that it's properly leveled against the LCD, but as you're tightening the screw, it can dig into this vertical screw and move it a little bit. Ideally, there'd be a little washer-like thing in there that's cupped to match the shape of the outer diameter of this screw and it's flat on the other end so that this screw could push up against it, but it's not going to rotate and affect the level of this screw. We could probably actually 3D print a little plastic piece that goes in there that would work perfectly for that. For right now, I'm just going to use a bearing in each one. These are approximately 1 8 inch or 4 millimeter bearings and they fit perfectly in there inside of the threads. So it's going to go inside this hole and the screw is going to push against the bearing and the bearing is going to push against the shaft of this vertical screw. Now, you don't want to over tighten that because that ball bearing could dent that screw and make some, make some dents in it. And then when you try to put it in another position, slightly offset from that dent, it wants to go fall back into that dent. So this is not necessarily the ideal solution, but it is better than driving the tip of that screw directly against the vertical screw. The best solution would be to make a little custom washer that fits the shape of this vertical screw. Once those are loose, then you can turn the handle such that it is also all the way loose. Make sure that the LCD screen is clean and free of any debris or resin. Take the Jupiter leveling card, which is this instruction card, as far as I can tell, and going to go to tools, manual, and then we're going to push this leveling button. And the z-axis is going to lower onto this card here. And we're just going to wait for that to come to a stop. Okay, so now they want you to put your hand on here and apply some downward force onto the build plate towards the LCD. Make sure that all your leveling screws are still loose. And now with pressure being applied to the build plate, we're going to hand tighten these screws first. So go from the front right to the back left. The back left is kind of sticky, so I'm about to use the wrench. And then the front left and the back right. And then I'm going to do this again with the wrench now all the way around. Front right, back left. And you don't want to over tighten if you go too crazy, it might mess things up. Okay, now I'm going to tighten up the release handle. And this release handle, you just want it snug. You don't want it too tight because if you tighten this up too much, it's going to warp these plates. I mean, basically, it wants to suck these plates together. It's going to bend stuff, it's going to throw stuff out of calibration. I'm going to check the tightness of the sheet under here. The sheet is currently so tight I cannot move it. So I'm going to go up by 0.1 millimeter. And now I can slip the sheet around a little bit. Let me check the corners to see if the corners feel like there's even amount of force being applied. feels okay. The front left is a tiny bit tighter than everything else, but feels pretty even overall. This one feels the loosest. I'm going to go up 0.1 again. Feels about the same everywhere now. I'm going to try to check the center, which I said was also 
the lowest when I measured things. And the center feels about the same as everything else. I go down by 0.1. It all feels pretty good and level at this point. So now we're going to go back up by 10. And it should be leveled again. Make sure you don't crank down too much on this handle here. Clean off the surface of the LCD with a clean microfiber cloth. Just gently remove any dust or debris on there. Do the same thing with the bottom of the vat. Just clean it off gently. I noticed that trying to clean this off with a microfiber cloth create a lot of static electricity. Probably just blowing it off with some air would be the best.